Oh wow, Jojo! Somebody's <laughs> extremely <laughs> excited. <laughs> God. Did you hear you, Gigi? Yeah. She said, have a blessed day. We have Dr. Julian here taking his sister's That's temperature. Dr. Me. Oh, okay. He won't let me be a doctor. Well, isn't it a sad, sad world? Back to Dr. Julian. It's not. I think it's doctor time to go to school before he get put in time out before he even get there. Hmm. Yep, this is happening today. It's all right. I got a beat from Kim and she can do it all. Pumpkin spot. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let me show y'all all this life that this latte is giving me this morning. Life born. It's been named. It has a birth certificate. It's called the Starbucks pumpkin latte. Yes. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Oh, is that nutmeg? Oh, it's nutmeg. Mmm. Mmm. In the name of Jesus, I just want to say a prayer right now. Dear Lord, I want to thank you right now for all these 500 to 600 calories that you were offering me in this mini tall drink this morning. And I know it's not nutritional whatsoever. Maybe the whipped cream is giving me some type of uh, protein. I don't know, but it's delicious. Thank you. Amen. Hope you bowed your head. Amen. Life. I wish. Okay, so y'all, excuse my look today. I am a hot mess happening again. Izzy is still running a fever. I gotta call his doctor to see if he can be seen today or can they squeeze him in on Monday or I'm just gonna have to steal some um, medicine from these people. You keep telling me that it's viral and that you just have to kind of wait it out but I'm about to go steal me some amoxicillin, zithromycin, some cephalosporins. I don't know, I will rob a pharmacy for my baby. I'm sorry, I'm lying, I don't wanna go to jail. I mean, I would, but I ain't got no bail money and I got three other kids to live for. But I'm saying I would, I would. Um, I gotta run to this grocery store to get him some more Gatorades and whatnot and just try and figure out what I'm gonna throw together for dinner because I need to cook. I really don't like eating out as much. Number one, it's expensive and um, it's unhealthy. And um, I'm just trying to do better about cooking more at home, which I have been doing pretty well like for the past two weeks, uh, which you guys will see a lot more of, of me cooking. But I just have, it seems like I just haven't been able to get to the grocery store. Like yesterday I wanted to go to the grocery store and I couldn't get to the grocery store whatsoever. And I'm talking really fast, that's my Duval coming out, y'all. People in Duval talk real, real fast, even though we're from the South. Like we talk really fast and it just kind of rolls. You know, like how the toilet paper roll off the toilet tissue. I mean, I'm just saying that's not a real good analogy, but that's how it feels. It just rolls right on off, girl. Before you know it, it's all gone. Um, got to run in here, so we'll chat later about the goings on of the goings on about my life. Okay, let me. Let's just mom. Let's just mom it out. You wanna go? You wanna go mom it out with me, best friend? We're gonna go to the grocery store and get a couple of things, <sighs> and then head back home. I need to clean my room again because Izzy's been sleeping in the bed with me but I wash my sheets whatever kind of to like disinfect the whole area to stop everybody from getting sick everybody everybody gets sick you can get sick you can get sick your mom can get sick everybody gonna get sick <coughs> there you go thank you you just earned yourself a day off from work hanging out with me <laughs> no all right check please do you know what time it is Halloween it's fall time. Is it September? Oh, we ain't even through September. They got all the Halloween stuff out. Marketing, I tell you. Marketing makes you just want to buy it right now before it's the end. Ooh, I probably need to get princesses because every time I come back here, it's always gone. 
I want to be superheroes this year. We're going to be the Avengers. Superwoman. I think I want to be Wonder Woman this year, y'all. Okay. Well. It's. What time is it? It's Friday. Number one. Friday! And. It's about. Look, I'm so lazy. I don't even want to tell the time on my watch. It's about 4.30. Um, I need to cook dinner. I'm supposed to go out on a date tonight, but I don't know. You ever been so tired that you just don't want to do anything? You just want to sit in the house? That's how I feel right now. Like, as much as I want to go out, like, my mind wants to go out, but my body... My mind is telling me no. But my body, my body is telling me yes one of those moments or is it my body that's telling me my body's telling me yes but my mind is telling me no because my body's like oh yeah girl uh. no check please so yeah whichever way um i need to make dinner still did i did i say that i need to make dinner still my arm is doing p90 x y'all i want to show y'all this shirt that i have on today it is so cute look it says blah 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 <laughs> sometimes that's all it is so i'm gonna show y'all my counter and i probably shouldn't show y'all what my counter space looks like but this is what i'm working with this is this is what happens on the countertop and then i have to clean it if i even have to go somewhere like i can't like get ready when everything's messy so i have to clean my counter space and then that'll determine whether or not i want to go somewhere tonight or not but look at my counter space y'all how how who why y'all i just got picked at this curl and i you nasty people thought it was something else y'all need jesus um so yeah i think i'm gonna try this curling iron out today i'm kind of excited about it anyway that is what life is looking like for me let me figure out what i'm doing in my life let me try and clean up my counter space slam together some meals a dinner for my children um the twins are already bathed it's just the boys i think they have karate today but they talk about they don't want to go to karate today but if they don't go to karate today then i have to wake up at 11 in the morning and take them to make up for the day they miss but i feel like i need a little break i just need a little moment because i've just been running around and lack of sleep is really getting to me <sighs> Oh, that Tupac shirt that I was wearing earlier, you guys always ask me where I get it from. I got it from Target. Can you believe that Target is down with the urban people? <laughs> down with yay, yay. No? Is that Tupac? No. Wait. Never mind. Check, please. I like this. I actually curl my hair really nice, you guys. Izzy, yeah. leave that door alone. Okay, wait a minute, let me stop this down. Okay, <clears throat> so, I am in the car right now, you guys. I don't know what this lighting is doing. Hey, how, no. Um, but I'm about to go out on a date with Bay. <laughs> so weird, isn't it, y'all? Isn't it so weird, the transformation of my life over the past, what, year and a little bit of change? Isn't it crazy? But that's how you know we're best friends and you guys have known me for a long time because things happen in people's lives. But yesterday, I let a little bit of my synthetic hair down. No, actually my Brazilian hair down with y'all. And, you know, for the, for the most part, I try and keep a lot of that stuff hidden. I have really tried to, like, not talk about, look at my eye twitching because stress does it doesn't it doesn't do me any good y'all like you know i was having eye problems and stressed out and like extreme anxiety and 
yesterday i think i almost had an anxiety attack just because of everything you know and stress on top of stress on top of no sleep it will do it to you um but i will say uh y'all it's just a part of my life right now it's another phase of you know the journey or whatever and it's lighting i hate that this lighting is this way and i'm sorry y'all but um yeah i don't talk about it a lot because i think it will become just like excessive because it's not something that i'm just starting to deal with this is what i've been dealing with and a lot of times why i just put down the camera and i'll go miss it for weeks at a time because i get so i won't even say bothered but it's just like you know when somebody intentionally tries to bother you and intentionally tries to mess with your spirit and then um I don't know what's the, I don't know the word that I'm looking for. You know, they just, it's, it's, it's intentional because they're unhappy at this moment and, and I get it. But, um, in order to co-parent, there has to be respect on both ends. If I'm not picking up the phone and trying to cuss you out, you shouldn't be doing the same thing y'all. And it's just like, it's not the first time or the last time y'all literally, I feel like Whenever I talk to him on the phone, which I don't do anymore, I saw a lot of comments that says just don't pick up the phone here, which is why I no longer even hear his voice anymore. It's always through a text message because when he does beg me on the phone to get on the phone with him, he's always like, how are the kids? Who you screwing? Or I'm like, is there anything else you want to talk about? And he'll be like, yeah, who you screwing? You know, um, or you're a bad mom or, you know, and I feel like for me, I have to have so much self-restraint for the situation because um if i get crazy and ignorant on the phone my kids are watching he can get crazy and ignorant on the phone because nobody's there watching him except whoever whatever he doing which nobody cares about you know but i just feel like i have to have so much godly uh restraint in me that i really feel like i'm about to like bust a brain vessel or something you know what i'm saying so um I know you, some of y'all, I know it's hard to even, I just had to let it out, y'all. That's all I'm trying to say. I can't even say that I'm, I, I just can't, I just can't because guess what? At the end of the day, when I like have my like crying moments and stuff, I just look crazy. Like you guys don't know like what's going on behind the scenes. Just like I look crazy and I'm just tired of looking crazy. So I don't mean to like overvent or whatever, but today is a better day for me. Um it's hot in this car i'm about to get out and run into target before i go on my date with my boo saying y'all but um yeah so i just deal with a lot you know i i deal with a lot and i try and suppress a lot and i don't try and talk about it as much because i feel like it doesn't get me farther the best thing that i can do is just move along and um you know the only way that we do communicate is through the only way that I'm willing to communicate now is through text messages. I have nothing to say on the phone to this person. You know, I just feel like every opportunity I, he, I could say the wind is blowing and he was like, I don't give a damn about you. Or, oh, Jojo's hair has gotten so long. I don't give a damn about you. You know, it's just like the verbal abuse is enough. And I'm tired of hiding it because I think I hid that person's behavior for so long for so long to the point where it was unbelievable to a lot of people that this person is the way that they are um with me and 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 things but you know i can say that i'm trying to work on myself better because we are no longer married so i don't have a reason to be angry with him you're not my man you know if you was my man you know, I, I would be upset, but you're not my man, and it's not worth the time, you guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run in here to Tarjay. Y'all want to go into Tarjay with me real quick before I, I meet up with Bay? Let's go into Tarjay real quick. This, yeah, I need to get something. I need to get something, child. I need to get something, and then um, I'll see y'all on Snapchat. Or I just might vlog, but I'm going to, yeah, just, yeah. You, you know, just sometimes you'll feel like your whole life is just dis disheveled. How I'm feeling. Oh, look, extra light. Oh, look at that extra light just came through. Whole time I was talking in the darkness for no reason. Look at that. Oh, let there be light. He said, let there be light. <sighs> Thank you.